just I want to say hello. Very nice to be here at this great show. It's my very first time. My name is uh, Manfred Diestertich. I'm the, the Audi Physik designer now for more than 20 years. So all speakers you see from Audi Physik here at the show or wherever are finally designed by me. Avantera in principle was launched some more than 10 years ago, but the Avantera 3 now carries all the latest driver technologies that we design in-house. We have very unique uh, designs that no other company in the world might have at this time. Uh, what's very special for Avantera 3 is, um, I just want to show this, um, if you look at Avantera 3 in principle, you will think there is a nice silk dome tweeter, but the general driver, it's a, it's a cone. So it's an aluminum metal cone. And why did I go for a cone? Because our mid-range driver uses an aluminum cone as well. So I wanted to have the, the perfect blending between mid-range and tweeter, which I could not achieve with, with anything similar to this. So for me, any mix of drivers from ribbon tweeters to soft domes or whatever is always creating some, some trouble. And this I want to avoid and you can easily judge this if you take a listen to any of our speakers. So major technology in Avantera, the new metal cone, uh, mid-range and, and tweeter in the third generation and this is why it's named Avantera 3. A method that is named active cone damping. If you have a normal metal cone, it's, it's ringing. And this is why people say, I don't like to have any metal in my system. But if you treat the metal correctly with our active cone, it's quiet because we pre-stress uh, this cone. Similar effect if you take this here. It's ringing. But if I apply active cone damping, dead. So very easy, but very efficient way to control resonances. All drivers, other drivers in the Avantera, the crossover, the internal damping are all at the latest technology. This is why the Avantera 3 is the product of this show. It uses a well something unique for us and which is allowing us to create smaller cabinets than, than many others do. This is a material named uh, ceramic foam. It's made of uh, silicon carbide. And the good thing in this material, it's extremely rigid, but it's 85% air. So if I use a normal brace in a speaker, I'm losing all 100% of the, its volume. If I use this, I'm losing just 15%. So I can use a lot of bracing and I can build up heavy, massive walls, but the internal structure is allowing much more net volume. Yeah, our goal is always to, to build speakers as big as they have to be, because the big cabinets are only needed because you want to have the, the lowest frequencies. You need the volume just for the woofers. You don't need it for the tweeter or mid-range. Many people they, people, they prefer very small bookshelf monitor speakers because of their famous imaging. I want to combine the imaging of a bookshelf speaker with the low frequency response of a big speaker. This is why we are using ceramic foam and all these special technologies specially made drivers because I want to keep the size of the speaker small. Because the big speaker has a lot huge surface creating the secondary resonances, reflections, all negative effects. So to make a speaker as small as possible is always an advantage in my opinion. Most important for me and for all the team of Audio Physique is that if you have our speaker, you can sit, listen to your preferred music. We don't say this speaker is only made for classical, for jazz. So you listen to your music, the music you like, with the electronics, the cables that you like. You close your eyes and everything disappears except that the music is there. 
So you hear all the detail, you hear all the imaging. Very important that the imaging is there and that the speaker really disappears. You can listen for hours without being stressed. Drink a nice glass of wine or whatever you prefer, or good whiskey or cognac. And enjoy. And after one or two hours of listening, you feel relaxed like, like from a short holiday. Then we have achieved our, our goal. Musik verbindet Menschen, Emotionen, Gefühle, egal welche Geschmäcker man trifft. Musik ist einfach ein Mehrwert im Leben.